Welcome, welcome back everyone to another edition of Jay's Minecraft Explorations. Whoa! Wow, it's actually snowing. Really? And this is for Minecraft 114.4 Java Edition. I'm not sure what we're going to do today, but since it's snowing, I guess we can be happy that it is. Uh, yeah. I'd really like to fix the ground out here since I had to slaughter some of this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop these trees down and I'm going to put them on this higher land here. Well, let's do it real quick. Change of plans again. You know, where I live at, we don't get snow. So even just seeing it in Minecraft is a treat. Now some don't like to shovel it and stuff. Well, we had a dust storm not too long ago, and that was not fun to clean up. So now what I'm going to do is take these trees and slowly pull them down until before the snow uh, goes away forever. Okay. So what I'd like to do is plant my trees out in a certain area out here. We're going to plant it. Let's plant this one right there. We'll start there for right now. And we'll slowly pull these out. I want to get this whole ground whited out. Brr, it's nice and cold out there. Just seeing the snow now makes this really feel like a winter cabin. Maybe I should make this episode winter is here. Or be like, oh wow, we're getting snow. Alright, let's put this in the back here. Let's grab those sticks. And pretty soon we won't use this as a tree tree farm anymore. I mean, somewhere else it's probably raining. It's probably raining back up over there since it's uh, not really a snow biome. Okay. In fact, I should just make a shovel, scoop up some snow, and then kind of put it around the edges in here to make it look like it really snowed in. Pull that flower out too. Okay. I'm trying to find a place to stuff that. Close that. We don't need to let any of the warm air out. Let's start compacting things so I don't mess up and have to lose it all. Oh, I'm really tight. I should just call this whole, this episode here, warming by the fire and smelting things, because basically that's all I'm going to be doing in here at this point. You know, but we do need to progress and work on the farm. Let's see. So, what do I want to do? Let's take advantage of the snow. Maybe I should start scooping some of this up. Yes, it's already filling that in back here. This needs to be filled in a bit more, too. First day, we're just going to get things prepared, clean up some stuff, stay warm in the cabin, and I'm trying to remember where I put all the wood at. Let's put that in there. I guess you can't, but I can put that in there. Put that in there. Any space in there for that? No, but I'll put it that in there. Okay.
Where do I want to go today? I could clear out more of that farm. Wow, that sure came really grew well. I wonder if it's... Oh, there it is. There's the rain. Well, we don't hear that out here where I'm at, too, so... I'm going to take this downstairs. And we're going to plant it. Because I really want to keep up with that sugarcane farm and everything. We need to keep up on all that. I just want to get things going. I need to enchant... I know you guys and gals have been saying, Jay, where's the shovel? Where's the armor at? You know? I mean, I want to enchant this stuff. Not just sit here and look at it, you know? Alright, well, at least this is... I don't think this is going to grow anymore. I think I actually have to have more space in here for this. So... Well, let me put it at the top. Okay, it will. Maybe because I'm just impatient. I'm in a rush. All right. Oh, I'm just one short, too, and no watermelons. Got my diamonds for safekeeping. all that. Okay. I'm going to bet you anything it's that area that right above, the, that room right above this. Oh yeah, let's uh, not go any further. could be this up here. I can't tell. Maybe it was. I can't tell. Maybe I should take that leftover stone and just backfill all these chambers in. But I don't know if I'm going to need to remove this out for tree farming or, or what. So I can't just, you know, accurately say what I want to do. I mean, we can poke around that nether some more, but I'd like to really get on the enchantment room. So today will be that day. <laughs> Maybe we'll get an, we'll get lucky and we'll be able to put some books in there and the enchantment table and we may see what kind of enchantments we'll get. I'm not going to promise I'm going to enchant anything, but at least I can start on the actual room itself. Well, decorating it, that is. Oh, wow, look how pretty everything looks. All nice and white, white out, what you guys may call when it snows. pop this dirt out. It's kind of sloppy. I should make the title of this. Oh, look, it's snowing. Yeah, maybe I should. There we go. There. Now, this is like a winter wonderland right now. Let's take that dirt and let's fill more of this in right here. There we go. I want to just fill the whole thing with trees. Alright, one, hold your horses. I'm going to make a shovel. Not that. A shovel. Alright, so I'm going to try something here.
I'm gonna try some. Oh, it's already getting dark. I want to see if. I think. Uh, I'm trying to think of how you'd make slabs. I've seen a recipe for it. Um, something. Oh yes, you can. So it's like carpet. And then I was thinking of just uh, stuffing these down here. I, it's just for visual purposes. Like the snow kind of just filled in that area. And probably for some who don't know, you can actually uh, stack those snow pack, those snow things on top of one another. Well, let's go to bed. Let's hope the snow doesn't go away. Okay, another morning. Let's see. Oh, yes, it is still snowing good. Maybe we're getting lucky. Maybe it's all that lost time that we're making up for. All right, so I got the snow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right. So I'll show you what I what I'm talking about here. I mean, I'm I'm sure most of you know this, but I I read up on it. So you can actually come in here and do this. So if you really want to get creative, something like that, where it looks like it kind of piles up in the corner. So. You can actually walk on them like stairs, too. So, add a little more character to the cabin. Just kind of pile it up in certain areas. Okay. So, where do I want to start with this whole lava bit? I don't know if I'm going to call this this I don't want to be like oh look it's snowing or do I call it something else I don't know yet let's get rid of these more seeds let's let's just drop off let me go get let's go back downstairs we're gonna see if we could do something about that um, see how our wheat's doing how our sugar cane's doing even if we could start breeding cows and killing those for leather and meat at least you guys and gals can say, hey, I got to see you eat something other than potatoes. <laughs> That's all I'm having is baked potatoes. Now if I had some steak to go with it, it'd be cool. I guarantee I bet this goes there. I'm going to slowly scoop the top of that off. Uh-oh. Oh, wow, look at that. You're one of those generic zombies that does nothing. Yeah, what a waste of my time. You made my axe go dull, dull, too. I guess we could start building our beetroot farm in here. I mean, we won't get far with it, but we'll see. Did I fill up? I did. I'm just gonna shove that back there. Okay. Oh, that's right. We were short that one piece. Well, I can't pick it up, so. Wait a minute. How's the wheat? Oh, yeah. Of course it would be all grown because I'm overflowed in my inventory. That's cute. I guess I'll have to go up and clear things out. So I can harvest all that, replant it, breed some cows. I mean, that, that pen's going to get so packed. Just, just Then just go in and start swinging. And maybe we'll get some bookshelves today. I'm going to need 40... Let's see here. Let's take a look at how many leather I'm going to need. Let's uh, get that going in there. Put that there. Trying to find a place to shove it. Shove it there. Okay. 6, 12, 18. So that'd be 18, uh, 32. That's uh, going to need a lot of leather. 32, 64. No. 32, 
Yeah, I don't know. It's one of those days where I can't think. Here I was talking about a math channel. I can't think of those numbers off the top of my head. Oh, wow, we're in trouble now. <laughs> All right. Let's go and shovel more sh snow. Any trees that grew? No. Coming to bother me, huh? You know, you're on private property. Don't trespass again. Oh, well, you won't have that. You don't have to worry about that problem anymore. I took care of that. All right. I got one too many here. You think if, uh, these look like these are just two blocks thick, or two, uh, pixels thick. You think you'd, uh, if you were to do that, wouldn't you get more? I don't like that recipe. Oh. Yeah, it looks a lot better. Doesn't look too lame. Oh, wow, this is all nice and, uh, wintered up. No, I've never really been in here. Don't want that to go to waste. Really? Seriously? Well, I'll, I'll take all that. Boy, this is a nice, uh, this is a nice ink sack farm. <laughs> So that, all that time that took us back over there, I should just fill that in with a bunch of stone, just pack that in good. Just be like, okay, I'm done. Playing in the snow. That would be a good title for this. Playing in the snow. So I wish you can make, like, stairs and stuff with this. Just for fun. Like a fun block. Or make stairs out of ice so you can slip on them and fall. There we go. So now when the snow falls in here, it'll really fill this in. Get that out of here. Pull that. I want it all I want this whole thing whited out. I'm gonna rip those out. Just shove these over here in the rainy biome. Here, one of those squids in there dying. And some more ink sacks for Jay. Oh, that's right, I forgot. We've got our obligations. I gotta go in and pull out a wheat farm. Well, let's do that real quick. We need to get ourselves a priest villager so we can uh, trade that rotten flesh in for something cool. Get that or a farmer. Or a villager that just has some useful stuff. Maybe, you know, or a librarian or something. Alright, let's take care of the farm. I mean, who needs a greenhouse, right? When you can just dig a hole into the ground and go, oh, look, I'm done. Well, I'll raise these ceilings up eventually. Don't mess up. You only got a 80 of these things to plant. Oh, that hurt something. chicken out. Here chickens, knock yourself out with this. Come on, move it, let the chicken eat. Here. You can have all that too. I don't need all that anymore. Hmm. Here, you can have more. 
can have all. It's all you can eat. You can have that because I'm overflowed. Let's go ahead and start breeding the cows. Boy, it's going to get so noisy in here, it's not even going to be funny. Oh, let's just breed them all. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just, I'm just walking around. I need to breed some pigs too. Oh wow! Come on, move. Let me get out. You're gonna squish me to death in there. Oh, oh wow! Really? Uh oh. Well, you shouldn't escape. I wouldn't have to do that. Now, look what you made me do. It's all your fault, cow. You shouldn't have done that. I wouldn't have swung the axe at you. But we did get some melons, though. And let me just drop these seeds over there. Now the whole point of... Let's keep dumping the seeds, because... I've only got enough for two books. Okay, well, there's our sugarcane farm. I should just kill another cow. At least I'm going to say, okay, let's make a book. You can't get in now. Here, let me help you. There you go. You can get back in there. Oh. Oh. Oh, my. Okay, you see that axe? Don't you dare. You're going to get it. Okay. I don't have enough to make a book or three books, but at least have enough for something. I have enough to make uh, one bookshelf. I just thought of something. It would be 54 leathers, I believe, to make uh, 18 bookshelves. So, I got three of them. Right. Let's go to bed real quick. Okay, rise and shine. Let's put some of this stuff up here. I'll tell you what. Let's put the leather in here right now. And for the sugar cane, stick that in here. I'm going to save the crafting table for another day. Um, I don't know yet. We'll think. Because it's such a nice day and it's still snowing. Wow. really going to shoot at me while I'm playing in the snow, huh? Well, you shouldn't have done that. I wouldn't have had to have to axe you. Okay. Take that out of here. Yeah, this looks a lot better now when the snow's all filled in. Okay. I might as well set this somewhere. Okay. So basically, I'd like to smelt everything. Now, I mean, I could do this off video, too. But the point about keeping these raw and uncut is to show all the problems and the mistakes that I do in these things. And... You know, like some will edit those out, and oh man, let's just let's just edit them out so the the kitties don't get bored. Well, just like real life, you're gonna have to do boring things, so let's just get it out of the way. Okay, did I bring him back? Okay, I do have an empty lava bucket, so I guess I can scoop more lava out of that one pit. Drop that dirt off. Um, I guess I can pull that out. 
that there. Walk by the diamonds. Let's just pull that out while we're here. Oh, it's all your fault, Blue Sheet. I ran out of space. Okay. Yeah, why don't we just gather up all the stuff in the enchantment room? We'll just do that in one episode. <laughs> so this is just... It's snowing. We're just going to kind of piddle around, playing in the snow, doing farm. And... Um, Unless it stops snowing. I don't know. It's still snowing, really? Oh, wow. I don't know what game mode I have this thing set on. Maybe it's set on hard or something. I didn't even know it. Okay. Wait, but I don't know what the heck I'm doing. There we go. Let's put that up there. I guess nothing grows around those torches. I'll pull that out. At least one tree's grown. And we'll sit there. Let's do some more scooping. So yeah, it looks a lot better though with it all uh, snowed in around the cabin. Playing in the snow. Where I'm at, that's a luxury. Playing in the snow, because we don't get it in my area. I mean in real life, it, we just don't get snow. It just never happens. Maybe once, well I'm not going to say maybe, it does happen once in a blue moon and it does but infrequently, though. Now, let's go. Let's uh, let's go down here. I haven't killed anything in a while. Who needs a lot of armor when you can just be careful? Well, we don't need an XP farm, pretty much. I'm already racking it enough. Whoops. Alright. Uh, put in there. Let's grab those. We'll set that in there. And... So basically, it's just smelting, smelting, smelting. Some would just say throw it out, but I'm going to need it for other, uh, for another adventures. All right. So I'm just going to have some bookshelves here, maybe a couple of workstations. I can probably move that loom in there. You know what? Let's wait. We get all the stuff built. I know something we can build right now. An anvil. Well, that doesn't do any good. I don't think I have any more around here. Yeah, I do. I should drop that on my head and see what it does. Okay. Matter of fact, there's the anvil. <laughs> we got one thing made for the enchantment room. Alright. Okay, so... Let's go back down and... Um, I may have to make a bunch of furnaces and just set them at the bottom down here and just go ham on it. So just that one furnace is not going to get us anywhere. That's 
right. Stuff yourselves, my pretties. Stuff yourselves. I don't know what that means. It means I get to have a, a nice dinner. Enough space. Let's go axe ourselves another cow. You've been chosen! Just one? What about you? You didn't give me anything? Okay. I'm not leaving until I get three. have a lot of meat. Okay, we're done. Don't worry, I'm done killing. Oh, let's just do everything. We'll just do a feed buy. We'll just feed by everything. We'll just keep walking until we run out. Oh, goodness, that is so noisy in there. That gives us now to make two bookshelves. <laughs> two down. 16 more to go. Wow, that is going to take a long time. We've already made our anvil. Got to figure out how to make that map table. We can stick that map table in there. Not math, map. All right, so let's put that leather in there. We're going to need 54. Actually, no, we're going to need 55 because we need to make the enchantment table, too. It's going to be nice to have some color in here. Well, I guess we can go to bed. Okay. So we got that in there. That's done. Not done. We got plenty of stone. I mean, we started out, we had plenty of stone. We were traveling, we ran out of stone. So if you stay in one place too long, you will get more stone. Guaranteed. I'll set this in here. Okay, where do I want to go? It's so tempting to go to another... It's still snowing? Really? I mean... I think my game's messed up. Let's pull down another tree that's got a big bald spot underneath. Oh, this one's perfect. Creepy screeching noise. There we go. Let's go scoop more snow here. Okay. At least we're going to fix up all the bald spots. Notice it hadn't snowed here. I'm wondering if this lantern 
keeps it pretty warm and toasty. I'm going to start sticking some of these down in and see what it does. Oh, yeah, it disappeared, so the lantern is keeping this warm. Well, that's better than nothing, then. We can plant something in that corner. Lesson learned. Lesson learned. I mean, I know regular torches pretty much do that now, but I didn't know lanterns do. I know you got... Yeah, see how it's defrosting all this? I may just come in here and... Uh, do something with it. Okay. Um, got six leathers, 15 sugar canes. Now we got 21. Got plenty of steaks. Hey! Uh -huh. What do you think you're doing? Uh -huh. Trespassing? Is that what you just said? Oh, you have... Uh -huh. No, you don't have... You have junk. This is junk items. Uh -huh. No, it's junk. Look at this. Uh -huh. Why would I give you an emerald for... Uh -huh. No, that's not a deal. That's, that's junk. Look at this. Vines for an emerald. You might want to leave my house here. Don't let the door bump you in the butt when you leave. You don't have any good things at all. And I have two emeralds for you, too. What did you do, steal my emeralds? Did I just drop them? Did he just take my emeralds? Oh, there they are. I'm sorry, but you have junk. Nobody wants your overpriced junk. Get out of my house. Before I axe you out of there. <laughs> no, you heard what I said. I'll, I'll beat up your llama. Okay. Whoops. Put that back over there. Move! Come on! Fine, I was gonna... Your, llama, your llama's pretty silly. Alright. Keep that stoked up. And... That gives me 26. I'll go downstairs and kill another cow. Maybe we'll have enough to make a bunch of books in here. Do you see? I need a. I'm gonna need 55 books to complete a whole enchantment room, and that's not including enchantments too. So I'm just gonna start stocking up on leather. That villager had, or that wandering trader villager, whatever his name is, had that nerve to come into my house and charge those prices. Oh. He's got, Yes. Your contribution is needed. Yes. I gotta kill off some of these one sheep. Making sure I have enough large cows. Okay, I got enough there. Okay, I got rid of something. Okay, whose eggs are these? Here, you can have them back. Okay. I think these things are going to dead stop here. I think I'm going to have to make this up a bit higher. So I'm going to... So, you need 55 leathers. That would be 110. 
165 uh, pieces of paper. It's a lot. Oh man, what am I? What am I writing a dissertation? Probably so, but so I think the next uh, game day we're going to start really focusing on because now we have source of sugarcane. We got a source to make a an enchantment table. We have everything. All we need now is to stop procrastinating and actually get them going. I should push him down that hole. If I punch him, I know his llamas would be like all nasty and spit all over me. Alright. Well, that's enough to make three bookshelves. And wood's pretty easy because I got a bunch of wood around here. I guess I can go downstairs and start digging out a tree farm. Um, I guess I could, huh? Just start digging a tree farm. Yeah, you you can admire your junk all your all you want. Don't don't bother me. While you're selling junk, I'm gonna be producing high quality items down here in my underground hidden farm that nobody will find out except for me and everybody else who's watched this. I could put that tree farm back in here. Now, it depends on sizes of trees. I always like to go nine. So I could just start doing that now. So that's one, two, three. Oh. And how high do I want to go? Well, how high do I want to grow trees in here? I think level 30 is enough. So we got one, two, three, four. Five, seven, eight, nine. And we'll just backfill that in. And I'm going to go up to level 30. And the reason being is so we can grow like some spruce. 40 is also a good level too. Maybe we'll brave it and go that high. So this is level 18, that's 19, 20, 21, let's go back this way here, 22, 23, 24, 5, 6, I guess as far as we can go. It sounds silly that I'm putting that in there, but I can grow some really big trees in here and and just to uh, make this more secure, I'm going to seal that up a bit. Alright, just to seal it. Alright, we got more sugar cane. Well, I'm down here. You know what that means again. I gotta start swinging. Yes. Yes. Give me that. I need one more piece and I'm done. Okay, I'm done. Yes, I'm done. Yes, I'm done. I guess it's enough for four bookshelves. <laughs> yeah, it's so sad you gotta kill all those cows just to make one enchantment room. I mean, you have to kill like what? Let's say an average of three to four cows just to get a book. I ain't talking about waste, you know? So what am I gonna do? Just start, just start scarfing down meat. Right, well, I'm going to bed.
Uh-oh. Someone's still here. An uninvited guest. Mr. Squid Mr. Squidward with his bad trades that even are making me uh, angry. This will be our last game day, by the way. Don't be pushing! You're in my cabin. This is, this is my cabin, not your cabin. Push me again, I'm going to pour lava on you and give you a lava shower. I will. Yeah, so you even agree with me, too. I will pour that lava on you. I've done it before. Oh, oh. see, he agrees, too. <laughs> those, those, those villagers are always... They, they, they just, they're just something else. So, as far as for the tree farm, we'll worry about that later. But, let's look at, oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, I think these are going to dead stop here. I'm going to need to clear around it. I don't have enough space. I keep thinking I'm seeing something back there. So, what I'm proposing to do is scoop all this out. We're going to do it layer by layer. Once I get that safe in there, I'm going to just dig out my carrot farm and my beetroot farm. Then I'm going to put pumpkins and uh, some other stuff in the back. I don't want to go in the mine shaft. Uh, I'm going to pull out one cow, one sheep at a time. Just pull things out one at a time. Pigs and the chickens are fine. It's like they have different food. And then I'm going to put them in their respective pens. Now we got to find a way to get rid of this guy. Yeah, you're not welcome here. Squidward. I have a friend that uses my Minecraft server that calls them Squidwards. I guess they do look like them, but I'm don't really, I don't really watch SpongeBob, so I have no clue. All right, so pretty much we're gonna be here smelting and. This furnace has been running non-stop. Maybe I'm going to have to make a bunch of furnaces or something and just do it. Maybe put a furnace room down below. Uh, no, I could. I guess I can do that real quick. Uh, yeah. But you know what? I don't even have the space for that. Okay, we got plenty of those. Let's drop those off real quick. Put those in that mine shaft that we've already pretty much gutted. We found that treasure uh, that treasure chest and it didn't really have anything useful in there. And had, well, I had the beetroot seeds, but already found them, so at least it was better than nothing. Boy, this mine shaft is a mess. We need to clean this up. So, not a whole lot I can do. Uh, you know, the problem with Minecraft, sometimes these just take forever. I could go find another place to build and we can come back, or I can go into the nether, we can clean that up, so we got a lot of episodes we can do. Close that up. Okay. Okay, I thought maybe I need to... Ooh, I don't have any, uh... This is like I'm playing my own server. I'm literally just full of uh, stuff. 
Uh, see how that filled in right in there, real nice. This is all white in here. It looks really good. So, I can safely say we can't plant anything there. Two, th three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, whatever. I don't know. I don't care. I should, I should throw a snowball at that villager. I mean, he's trespassing, right? I mean, he's literally breaking the rule. So how do I know? He might grief my little house. Oh, I didn't want to do that. That's okay, I guess. You know, I wish you can stack these up like, um... You know, why can't we do that with slabs? Why can't we have, like, wood, wood paneling? We can make it different thicknesses. It's so cool. You heard me. See my want to see my pretty axe? It's pretty cool. Okay. He's just challenging me, isn't he? Alright, so we got our diamonds. Um, what else do we need to do? I guess I go back into the nether real quick and dig more, huh? I mean, just... We just go poke around somewhere else. It's not like we're doing anything special right now. It's, uh... I mean, if we get back to one of those other cabins, that'd be so cool. Oh wow, they got some melons too. They're really taking off. Yeah, that sugar cane's not growing anymore. Uh, let's try an experiment here. Is it just stopping because it doesn't have enough space? And, yeah, I mean, I can use a couple of observer blocks and we can make an automated farm, but... I'm not really for automation. I like to just... We got some more iron if we need it. Okay. Let's see if one of these grows up more than the other. We're going to do a limitation test. Tempted to pull all that glowstone out of there. You know, I haven't been up that way. Now I see why I haven't been up that way. I gotta make that jump. Well, why jump that? I'll just make it. I'll make a cheesy little bridge and set it and go, look, I'm done. I guess I can, huh? I mean, the nether's already junky anyways. I mean, it's not going to make a difference if I junkify it up a bit more. Just junkify the whole uh, property up. There we go. Uh, we don't want to have those forest fires. Don't want to have to deal with that and burn down the place. I mean, there's not really much to burn down in here anyways. <clears throat> I'll be surprised if we find something in here. Wow, I'm breaking things all over the place. Watch, there's one over here I don't even know. Sad face. Uh, boring. Wait a minute. Hold on. Sometimes they're buried inside this too, so I gotta be careful. 
Don't want to miss out on the boredomness. Oh, we don't want to fall down there. <laughs> Just hope I don't get lost, but no, it's back that way, the portal. Boy, the render distance on this is really shallow. Oh, oh, oh yeah, I see it right there. Oh, we got a mission. We have a mission. We'll do that in the next episode because I'm almost out of time and I don't like to keep you guys and gals around too long. Whoops. We're going to have to make some makeshift stairs. Hey, what do you think you're doing? I should have just punched you for that, but of course you'll get all your friends after me. Hey, when you're outnumbered, you don't want to deal with it. Oh, we'll be able to get a brewing stand in no time. Maybe. I mean, it's not going to hurt. Oh, okay, we need to get past this here. Uh oh. You're going to make me break more. Okay. Oh, we have those nether bricks. I guess I can come in and repair it, huh? Oh. A terrible fortress. Oh, well, maybe not. Uh oh. Okay, we're going to save that for the next episode because I'm going to have to find a way to get out of here now. Um, you know what? I got an idea. Okay. Put that there. That there. Take that back with me. Oh man, what a mess. You know what? I'm going to be honest. I don't even know how the heck I got through here without even getting lost. Oh, I hate to think I'm lost in here. It's back down that way. I didn't even go that far. Let me go back down this way then. I'm lost, everyone. I am lost. Don't ask me how. I remember I was digging stairs somewhere. Oh yeah, I heard something. So that tells me... Oh, there it is. I was digging there. I think. My heart's starting to pound because I don't want to die in here. This is not a... A very fun place to be in. I'm gonna have to jump it. Okay, well now we know where it's at. And how do we get back home? That's the question. Well, we find one item 
and we get lost. See, in these things, you, there's no landmarks. You know, went back up that way. No prize. I'm afraid one of these pigmen are going to get kind of careless and push me right off, so I'm trying to be very careful. I mean, at least I, uh, I have food. Um, and I have stone, I can make a furnace, and I can cook my steak. I could be here for a while. Let's go back up to that one area real quick. This may be a longer show after all, huh? We were just around here. Okay, those remember those red mushrooms? I planted those in there. Just so I will not get lost. Oh, I thought I fell in a hole. <laughs> Alright. Maybe I went back this way here. take that with me in case I went the wrong way. I don't want to get confused again. Well, that is definitely not the way I came. I mean, of course, I can always watch the replay, but since I film these in advance, it may be a while before I even get to from the editing files. You know what? I bet... I wonder if maybe I just climbed up this hill. Looking for some makeshift stairs. It's back over here somewhere, I know that. to uh, build a bridge over around that somehow. You know, the nether, I have a lot of respect for the nether. Because obviously if you don't, well... You can get killed in here. Well, I'm pretty close to where I need to be at. But... I may have to stop right here and just save it and be like, okay. I mean, I'm going deep into this. I can't even find my way out. Level 32. Well, I guess I can just start making a crafting table and start crafting the... Uh... Remember this. I don't know. Well, uh, rarely I ever stop in a game day like this, but I may have to. Ah, uh, because I am lost in the nether. No surprise. And of course your hunger goes down very fast in the nether. It's like the heat just dries you out. Let's see if we can walk back that way. Maybe I should have killed that blaze and just be happy, huh? That's not it. Next time I'm leaving a trail of breadcrumbs. It's just so tempting to jump in and say, okay, game over. <laughs> uh, I'm not going 
gonna be throwing the towel out easily. So it's back that way, but I can't find out how to get back over there. You know, for the nether not really having anything in it, it's easy to get lost. There's just no landmarks. I mean, it's a bunch of depression in here is what it is. I may just keep grabbing some of those red mushrooms for a while. At least I know where the fortress is at. Now, for an emergency... Oh, I didn't bring anything to make another portal. Like I said, you know, you gotta have a lot of respect in the nether because it can get pretty brutal. Where it's back over there. Oh, I'm not even paying attention. I would have fell down. That would have been the end of the game. We can get down back down to there somehow. Maybe I was down this way. Looks like I see some makeshift stairs. Well. I think that's it. I think we're going to have to stop in here because I don't want to you know, hang up the game for like two hours. Maybe I should have waited. Oh, look at all the little piglets. Wish you guys could help me out getting out of this miserable place. Okay. Um... You know what? Yeah. We're gonna have to, uh... We're gonna have to find a way to get out of here now. So let me work back to that fortress. And then, uh... Yeah. You know what? Hold on. I think I got a better idea. So, I am lost. I'm not gonna lie to you. I should have known better, but, you know, I should have, would have, could have. Well, even though we get lost here, I got plenty of food. I got a furnace. I can bake more stuff if I need to. Um, let's go back to that fortress real quick. Because we know that the cabin is back over there. I don't know how to get back there to it. And... We'll just save there. Yeah, we'll just uh, we'll do that. We'll do that. <laughs> and then once we, uh, well, maybe I just need to have a clear head. Well, if I can find it now, I think I'm just lost in here. I may have to just. Uh, Maybe do a part two and be like, okay, we're going to have to have ourselves a nether marathon. Make a furnace and just sit there and just mine out a bunch of stuff. And just go, just go hardcore in here and try to find our way. As I see that, there's the stairs that we dug. I mean, I'm actually going further. Oh, why couldn't there be nether wart down? Oh, well. Let's just grab it. I'm grabbing a piece. All I need is one piece anyways. You know, 
that's ten. Oh, I'm gonna have to go back that way. Well, maybe not. All right, let's just go for it. Okay, so let's try to backtrack ourselves. We went up this way, and we kind of zigzagged back from over there. So here's our steps. And we saw it right there. Now from here I'm kind of lost. But why would I hump over that anyways? I bet I was up here and went straight down off this side. But after that I'm lost because there's no stairs. Well, we ruled that area out. I didn't go up this way. That's pretty, pretty rough. So that tells me that this mushroom here could be wrong. We'll put that right there then. Put that there. would have to be that, huh? That mushroom there. We have to have came... Well, I see... Looks like those could be stairs. Put a mushroom there. And there. Put that there. Here's where I'm kind of lost. So, obviously I didn't go anywhere right here. That would be silly. I wonder if uh, I went back this way. Really, the nether gets, uh, you can get stir-crazy in here real quick. Especially when you're running out of food, because you, there's no more to rest. You're, you're going to fatigue out real quick. The only way I can suggest this is to make a furnace. We'll do another game day. Actually, I'm going to stop here and just do that. So I think that's it. <laughs> We're going to head back to that area with the um, the nether fortress and then we will uh, proceed the next game day in here. We're, lo We're stuck in here. This is a mess. I got myself in a pickle. Um, yeah, because there's not even anything here and I got a gas in here now that wants to, it's going to possibly kill me. All the mushrooms. I'm lost. I don't know what I did. Okay, get back to that area and we're going to stop. <laughs> so I'll have to find, I'll, I'll have to get out of this mess somehow. At least we know there's portals back behind me. I should punch one of those little pigmen. Oh yeah, I'll get sent back to my bed for sure. I'd have to find all my stuff. So... Well, that's it. We found it, but we're stuck. 
So, <laughs> until we meet again. Good night, everyone.